So, gents, what do you think the score will be in the first origin? And who do you think is going to win the series this year? Well, I just think, you know, I don't think you win down at Melbourne, but realistically, and I heard the Gus, the guru, say that, you know, this is probably New South Wales' best chance of winning. If they can knock, them, knock us over down in, in Melbourne. Melbourne, yeah, I think they so. Come to, Sydney. Come to Sydney and the chance there, but I, I, I can't see it happening. Well, 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 I can. I can see it happening, and a uh, few, few of the positions I'm a little bit worried about, especially in the halves, but I think, you know, the boys could come up for the day. But the big thing going for us is, Arthur, is that we, we, like two home games up here, we, we're really up against them. But with having, as we said before, having that game in Melbourne is a home game to us. We have to win that. The other good big reason why we can win this series, because in the modern day game of rugby league, the better side doesn't necessarily win matches. What the better you, side. What are you saying? There's other influences. Yes, there is. And the big influence, and I'll say this here, and, and I mean, refereeing in the NRL is damn atrocious, but the way this game of rugby league is, Arthur, because of all these little these little nitpicky penalties they can give and, 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 and that they could, it could be right or wrong, mate, there's just too many of them. And, and the better side doesn't win the game. So that will give us a big opportunity of beating Queensland. Mate, if we, if, we, if we get the spade of penalties, we're a hope. What are you trying to say? You found a, a grasshopper. <laughs> no, oh, come on, come on. Mate, he did give you a bit of help a too. A blue the, grasshopper. A blue grasshopper, which <laughs> would be nice if we did. But Arthur, you must admit this, refereeing is atrocious. Oh, mate, I just had a, a yap, yap to uh, uh, Billy, Billy Harrigan the other day and just told oh, him. It would have been a good some conversation. Of, some of those referees. But uh, he's an ad adamant that you've got to have the scrums the way they are, you've got to have knock ons the way they are. What about his ball control? Oh, well, that's okay. another story. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yes, 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 but anyway, that's that's how I feel about it, Arthur, yeah. and uh, and I think we're a hope. Yeah, I think you're no hope. <laughs> Gents, it's almost 30 years since the first state of origin. We meet a lot of people on the road, and everyone has those those infamous questions for you of what are you doing now, Tom and Arthur? Can you uh, enlighten us as to what's going on in the worlds of Tom Radonikus and Arthur Beetson? Well, what I'm doing now is, uh, and actually, uh, we, we do a lot of work for the, the K Factor and, uh, and actually, um, uh, you know, we do, do a lot of guest speaking work and stuff like that, and uh, which is tremendous, you know. And uh, Justin Karcher, who runs the K Factor, well, he's solely my manager, a bit a little bit different to Arthur, but uh, he also looks after Arthur, and uh, I do that. I have my own business, which is um, uh, Green Star Supplies. My partner is John Short, an ex-footballer himself from Brothers. Uh, but we, we we've got a, we got a reason we got a, a, a reasonable uh, business, and um, it's going quite well. Although times have been a little bit hard with us, but uh, it's going okay. And uh, so so um, Tom Radonik is um, my family's going well, my kids are going good, and uh, so so life 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 is pretty 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 good, you know. And, and the biggest thing too is uh, is the uh, is that. Um, which I, which I got started after I, I made the uh, infamous call, the uh, cattle dog. Uh, it's going tremendous now for me. Um, I've got partners in that, of course, is Justin Karcher and another chap who does, does the designs for us. But it's going very well, um, our cattle dog, and we do our uh, T-shirts, our caps and, um, and, and, and stuff like that. So it's really, it's really going terrific, the cattle dog. And I'm also tied up with Arthur in Birth of Origin, which we've got the rights to that. We also got member really with the birth of origin. So overall, I'm pretty happy with my lot, and uh, and I can still have a beer and enjoy a beer, you know. And uh, that's the most important thing. And we all get too serious in this world. And uh, and the good thing uh, when I go around with Arthur, we have have a lot of laughs. We we never get too serious. You do, do we, big fella? You're going to shortly, Tommy. Do you? No. Big black no. fella. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. What Tommy said is right. But I've uh, actually I found something that I'm really good at doing nothing. Well. <laughs> No, no, no. You enjoy no, no. a lot, No, I, no, I enjoy it. I, uh, you know, with the K Factor, you, Tommy and I do get out there and we do have a lot of laughs. And, and I've got to tell you, it's quite numerous on the road sometimes. We get out the, the back blocks, we do a lot of charity work. But also, I'm an, an Indigenous ambassador for uh, Centrelink. So I get out there, they roll me out, especially mm, great. with NADOC Week coming up. and So that's good. And uh, you know, apart from the fact that I'm a very proud Australian. Very proud Queensland around this time of the year, but most of all, very proud Blackfellas. So, 
Mate, you're going all right. You, people look at me and they say, how are you going, Arthur? They always wonder about your health. But, Eat me uh, twitchity grubs. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, no, but it's good. Me, uh, Tom, you know what it's like. You know, well, you've got boys too, but yeah. your daughter and all that. Because i got four sons. And they, I'm starting to cry thing, too, Arthur. Good, I'm starting to The cry good too. thing about it, mate, they're not hitting me. They're not hitting me back. <laughs> no, nah, that's right. Good uh, on so, you. So nah. it's good. They've got their, their house in order and... Uh, no, we enjoy life, Tommy. It's it's good that, uh, although, you know, I'd, I'd be a lot better if I was about 40 kilos lighter. Oh, that's right, Arthur, but don't you? <laughs> Long time with the toes up, Arthur. Yeah, you're right there, Tom. You wouldn't be dead for quids, would yeah. you? No, yeah. uh, we're having fun. And, of course, Tommy spoke about, you know, the cattle dog and all that and the birth of Origin T-shirts. But I've got a product out and because uh, Tommy bought his cattle dog out. And, and what it is, it's all about the fact that, uh, you know, the, for years... Queensland has been calling New South Wales cockroaches and of course New South Wales have returned served with uh, the cane toads. Well they're both pests. So Tommy's got his cattle dog company, he's got his t-shirts and I've got my Murray Yarksa and because I'm a very proud Aboriginal, what that means is Queensland mud crabs and that's what we are. And you hate, the, you hate the cattle dog, don't you? Oh, we hate the cattle dog. What With a passion. What we're going to do this year, one of my big claws is going to come out and snip Bite him by the tail, <laughs> one by the tail and one on the snout. <laughs> one on his testicle. <laughs> that big one. <laughs> Tommy's having a go at me, but I did do, because I spent 25 and a half years with the chooks. They're looking crook at the moment, but uh, what Man happened? I, but Man I was him. doing a little bit of recruitment for the West Tigers and... Uh, and uh, believe it or not, I just got a phone call from Freddie and he wants me to go back to Chooks as the forward coach. Uh, I, won't, I can't devote a lot of time there, but I suppose you know, in a lot of ways, my, I did play for three clubs in Sydney. Balmain were my first club and of course East, where I had most of my success. I won two premierships as the captain there with the team and of course it was two years with the Eels. But, uh, you know, I suppose well, the fact is uh, that, that I had some most success with East, so I, I regard the Roosters as my club a little bit, even though I had a great time at Balmain. The, all the blokes that I played with there, you know, they like Tom they're bloody great, good Great, they great years, aren't they? So uh, it's good that I've go, gone back and Freddie's, I don't know how long it'll last, because yeah, uh, they're, they're under the yeah. hammer a bit, the, the, the chooks, but hopefully we can sort of help dig them out of the mire a little bit, but uh, yeah, we'll see what is happens. Is it true, is it true that, that, that the big thing down in Sydney now is, is that if, if these, especially the forwards, you're the forwards coach, if they don't do what they're told, that you'll go and sit on them. <laughs> <laughs> no, I haven't, I haven't challenged them with that. Oh, okay. no, no, but uh, Tommy, you know, I'm a bit old school. You, you, you like anything no, that you and I say, we, we, the people say, oh, but they're dinosaurs. Now, Arthur, but, you, know, you, know, you know what you're doing, mate. Yeah, but, but Shane Richardson did say about, you know, and he was referring to Johnny Lang, not, not me, I suppose, but there are, there is a lot of football knowledge out there wasted. Oh, my word, Arthur. <laughs> now, Arthur, I know you. I don't you, know what that I, applies I know, to I do, me. I do know that you're passionate about, and I'm yeah, passionate, and, yeah, uh, yeah. but you, 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 your knowledge is absolutely wonderful. The best front row forward I've ever seen play. You know, oh. and, and I think... Uh, uh, even Willie Mason might show a bit of stuff. You're, you're the toughest. I'm you're yeah. the toughest. The toughest 12. Yeah, wasn't the toughest 12. Yeah, so, yeah. mate, yeah, we know that. Hooray. Billy Smith will be blowing up in the critter. Yeah, the critter. <laughs> what about the critter? Oh. He is anyway. Critter. Yeah. Come and see us. K Factor. Yep. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. There's just a bit of a teaser, a taste of uh, the two great rugby league legends, the immortal Arthur Beetson and the one and only Tommy Rodonigas. Now you can book the boys' show, it's called Birth of Origin. You can find the show on birthoforigin.com.au. A fantastic little fundraiser for sporting clubs, communities, charities, you name it. It's been a wonderful fundraiser. We have such great success with it. There's testimonials galore on the website. So give me a call. My name's Justin Karcher. You'll see my contact details on, on that website again, birthoforigin.com.au. We'd love to come and see you and entertain you for a good night and help you raise a lot of money. Thanks a lot. Bye.